Is this thing ever gonna start? Oh, there we go. Damn delay. Hey, Michelle, Michelle Rivera, a, a, a nice little young prospect to keep eye eye out on. He was on the Tim Zhu Geisha undercard. That was a good. That was a good fight right there. I haven't even watched the. I haven't even watched the main card yet. The main fight, but I I, I see. I heard about it, and seen the highlights and stuff. But I'm about to actually watch the fight in a second. But um, man, this, but 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 to put that on pause for the breaking news of Haney versus Cambosos. Hey, that's exciting, seriously. That's gonna be hype. Let me turn it down a little bit in the background. Michelle, Michelle Rivera, the uh, uh, Dominican. I guess he's like Ali. He, he looks like Ali. He, he, he kind of, at first I thought they just dubbed him like Ali because, you know, he's like, he has a build like Ali, tall, and I guess it kind of like uh, boxes like Ali a little bit. But, I mean, shoot, he kind of even like in the ring. He kind of he, he kind of looked like Ali from like the, the, camera, angle, the camera angle from back of the ways. I'm like, holy shit, that's, that's, that's pretty cool. Yeah, that, that's, that's pretty cool. But okay. Reaction video because I, I feel I, I feel like this is, what, this is kind of what I'm gonna aim at for real quickly, right? To do, do react react to the, the tweets, right? Basically, so shout out to Fight Hype, much love. Like I said, one of the one of the big the big booms for for boxing, you know, YouTube. But so I'm pretty sure everybody's seen. Let me see if it's gonna zoom in. It better zoom in. Hold on. Well, I mean, it doesn't matter. Get out of there. All right, everybody seen this video, right? Come on, lock in. All right, well, anyway, I'm going to read it. Shout out to Fight. <gasps> excuse me. Ah, excuse me. Excuse me. Breaking. George Cambosos and Devin Haney have struck a deal for June 5th bout in Melbourne, Australia. For the Undisputed Lightweight Championship, sources tell ESPN. Right? Rematch in Australia if Haney wins. Multi fight co-promotional deal for Haney with Top Rank and Lou DiBella. So, when I first instantly read that, I was like, man, I was like, that, that doesn't sound like, I was, I was like, man, I was like, okay, when I first read that, I was like, hell yeah, I was like, Haney's being a beast. I was like, Haney's being a little monster. Cause I mean, he's young and shit, you know? <laughs> Seriously though, but uh, he's being, well, he's, 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 trying to, he's trying to do some grown man stuff, you know what I mean? Grown man shit. So, uh, so now, seriously though, to to go to Australia, you know what I mean? Especially like during that, during everything right now, right? Like how the, the world was on lockdown and all kinds of shit. But to go to Australia, and then I heard Australia, <laughs> Australia is really stringent with their with like everything that's going on. Like they're very strict and everything like that. So to go to Australia and fight fight Cambosos, you know what I mean? Who who can, who can basically like choose and fight anybody, you know what I mean? So he was like basically like, okay, like, you know, he, he pretty much got that, you know, got the, you know, got the opportunity over everybody kind of. But he, I feel like maybe he's the only one who kind of took that, who would take the deal to go to Australia, you know, and fight in a whole different country. You know what I'm saying? Like an entirely different country. You know, that's, 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 that's big shit right there, man. Seriously. So he went out. So, okay. So going to Australia, but not just that though. The rematch in Australia, uh, Haney agreed for a rematch in Australia, right? That's the source, that's what the, you know, that's what the, according to the to fight hype. Rematch in Australia. So, I'm like, dang, I'm like, shit, man. I'm like, that, that's, I'm like, Haney's, he, all right, he's, he's, uh, he's, 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 he's really, truly better than himself. And he's, I think he's, he, he's like chasing greatness. You know what I mean? Seriously. That's, that's huge, man, to, to want to go to a different country. And then on top of that, to agree to fight a rematch in that country, so you so you basically you know you pretty much said okay I'm giving all my power away to the to the to the champion, you know to to the you know the A side basically right. I'm gonna just give it all away. But okay, I'm giving I'm, I'm even gonna I'm even gonna give it away if I win the fight. Like if I win the fight, I'm still you guys still got power. You still got you still you, you still kind of got almost like more power in a sense. Because you were fighting in Australia for the rematch, right? And then, so so the next little tweet, because they're going based off what Mike Coppinger said. I know people have different uh, views on Mike Coppinger. The fight will be pro the fight will be broadcast in prime. The fight will be broadcast 
in prime time on ESPN linear on June 4 4 per port port <laughs> on June 4 per man damn Mike Coppage you're a fucking illiterate bastard so sorry the fight will be broadcasted in prime time on ESPN Linear on June 4th per sources. That's what I would have fucking wrote down. Excuse me. Afternoon in Australia on June 5th. June 5th, yes. On June 5th, Mike Coppinger. No wonder you're wrong. Half the time came in spell. Sorry, I'm playing around. I'm just playing around. I'm pfft. Let me see my damn spelling. My, uh, my how I shorten, shorten, shorten words and shit. So, okay. So it would be prime time. Regular time, June four, fourth, which I'm assuming is uh you know it's prime time it's gonna be Saturday, June fourth, and then June fifth it's gonna be in Australia during the day, you know what I mean? So that's probably how that's gonna work. I wish I had a damn like a uh, calendar so I can like just complete, so I can just like quickly like confirm June. Yeah, it's gonna be on a Saturday though. It'll be it says prime time Saturday, so if not, someone correct me please. I know. Okay, so that's that's just. That's, Typical. Typical. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Us. Okay. Now we got. Here we go. Keith. I don't even know. <laughs> He's talking to Mike Coppinger, and he says, as part of Haney's multi-fight deal with Debella in top rank, immediate rematch in Australia if he beats Cambosos. If he wins twice. Haney's third fight of deal could be ESPN pay-per-view fight with Loma. Details in my story. First reported, Haney agreed to the two Cambosos fights. So basically, first agreed, Mike Coppinger was the one who reported the, the two Cambosos fights. So Keith, I don't know. Keith, I don't even know. I think IDEC I, Boxing says that there's a third fight in the uh, uh, that's part of the, the multi-fight deal. With Debella in top rank, so the third fight deal. Now, in to see to me, that even sounds more like Haney has given up even more type of leverage. You know what I mean? The more type of power in the equation. So he's giving up more numbers in the equation, giving away numbers. I don't know whatever you want to put the metaphor. To, because now there's a third fight in place. So basically. In order for this fight to this fight, this contract to have been signed, this contract to have been made, there's there is three fights in place to keep Haney around. To me, that seems like a lot. You know what I mean? It seems, that seems like that seems like a top rank and the op, and to, I feel like top rank and you know like um basically the the side that's not Haney, you know, and company. It seems like they're trying to keep hold to hold on to as much power as they possibly can. You know what I mean? Okay, like to have that rematch. I like the rematch clause, though, obviously. But to have them both in Australia, to have that rematch clause, like the, the rematch gonna be in Australia. Shit, and then, and then, and then the third fight that can that could be with Loma, and I'm pretty I'm pretty sure they, they're gonna set stipulations in that to say to make it to where um, they're gonna have most of the power or half the power at least, even though Haney won twice. So according to you know, so according to that according to that tweet, multi fight deal. If Haney wins twice, he can possibly possibly get a pay per view fight. I'm, see, that's okay. I don't like that shit. I'd have been like, man, if I was Haney, I'm like, fools. If I won once, mother, if I won once, yeah, yeah I'll, I'll give you a rematch so I can sign this damn shit. But uh, I'm, I'm gonna be the A side in the rematch, and and maybe I'll give you a third fight. You know what I'm saying? I wanna say, I wanna I wanna put no three fight deal. You guys keep most of the power in the three fight. You know, in the in the third fight. Heck no, that that's, that that sounds no. Mm -mm. Which you know, honestly, Bill Bill Haney does not seem like a dumb man. So I'm pretty sure it's a good it's a gravy deal for for you know what I'm saying the Haney's. You know, it's, it's not. A, I'm sure it's a great deal, not just a good deal. We would hope, we would hope. But so yeah, that's my so 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 initially seeing see, see, you know seeing the you know the breaking news, I wasn't too sure. Like I wasn't too sure like how. That I, that I that I that I um that I agree with the honest to tell you the truth. I wasn't too sure about it. I was like, man, I was like, I'm not sure if, it, if it's if it's gonna work out best for uh, Devin Haney just because you know like fighting like um I thought maybe the rematch could have been in, in America. You know what I mean? Like I th I thought that would have been appropriate. That that would have been proper. You know what I'm saying? It's like okay, I, I I'm going to Australia to fight you once 
and I'm, and I'm not, and, and if I win, I'm gonna fight you again. So I'm putting the re I'm, I'm agreeing to rematch even so if I win. But you want me to fight the rematch in Australia? Hell no. With rematch is gonna be in America, boo. It's gonna be in Vegas, or it's gonna be somewhere where I'm, I'm, I'm gonna draw, you know, a, a bigger crowd and shit. And that's gonna be huge back in the states. But but no. But instead, Haney d decided to agree to fight the rematch in Australia. And then possibly a third fight with Loma. Possibly, as like, to me, the way I took it is like, uh, he has PN is like, you know, top ranks. Like maybe we'll see. You know, you play your cards right, even though you won two fights. So, damn, it's, I got out of shape. My <laughs> it's like it itches right here. It's like, but uh, tickles, not itches, tickles. Boy, well, yeah, Mitch. But uh, <laughs> so yeah, I, I honestly initially I, I wasn't uh, I didn't care for this deal. I didn't care for for the way things seem, the way things are put put perceived. The way they put out there, you know what I mean? I don't, I don't care for it just, just yet. But we'll see, though. But the one thing that I, I will bet on, the one thing that I, that I do care for is Haney is making an incredible step, a very, very big step into trying to, you know, like secure, you know, a, a respect to his name. You know what I mean? Seriously, man. There's signing his contract. Once that, once that, once that bell rings, Haney needs to be given all the respect and love in the world, man. Straight the hell up. You know what I mean? I mean, seriously, just, I mean, you don't gotta love him, but, I, you know, I'm mean, like, just, just show him, show him, you know, that was more of a metaphor. Like, show him some love, man. Like, show him some damn respect, man. You know, give him a little love, man. Shit, like, like yeah, all right. I, you know, that was, because come on now, to sign us to go to Australia and on top of that, to sign a deal that involved a, a, a rematch in Australia and then, and then a third fight possibly somewhere with against Loma, you know, like, no, you know what I mean. Like I, I, I feel like like ESPN didn't disclose, you know, all, all the facts, you know, towards that, you know, for that third fight because they're trying to, like I say, you know, they're trying to, they're trying to maintain some, you know, most of the some of the leverage, most of the leverage, you know, most most of the power in that in, in, in that in that deal, that fight. <sighs> we'll see though. But hey, big, big, big respects, big, big, big love, big shout outs to fucking Haynes for this man, straight up. Forgive my swearing so much. Ah, I do. I really do want to stop swearing. So I always. I've been saying this for years though. I want to stop swearing. But not I was digress so much. Shout out to the eighties of eighties and straight up. That is. This is huge, man. Huge. Ooh, I can't wait to delve but delve into this fight. Seriously. Pass. Thank you for rolling with the punches. See you on the next one. Peace. Peace. Tim Zoo. Tim Zoo. <laughs> Peace.